this video will show you how to fix bad spacing between characters in PowerPoint like this. As you can see, the distance between characters look weird and uneven. Even it looks bad in this part. The cause of this problem is the bad printer driver. Yeah, I know what's in your mind. What is the connection between printer driver with the PowerPoint? I don't know how to explain it, but that is the problem. Let's try to fix it. First, let's close the PowerPoint, then we create a fake printer. Just to make sure this problem is caused by a printer driver. It's only for a test, you won't use this printer for actual printing. We open Device Manager, I'm using Windows 10. If you use another Windows version, it might be a little bit different way to open Device Manager. In Windows 10, click the search button, then type Device Manager. Click Action, add legacy hardware, click Next, install the hardware that I manually select from a list. Next, click Printers, Next, use an existing port, choose LPT1 or File, Print to File. Next, choose the brand and type, anything, it doesn't matter. Next. Type a name, for example, dummy printer. Next. Do not share this printer. Then tick set as default printer. Finish. Now let's see if this way solves the problem. As you can see, now it looks okay. It confirmed that the problem is caused by the printer driver. But if it still looks messy, then it means this problem is caused by another thing. However, if this way solve your problem, then it means you just need to update your real printer driver. There is some case when you already update the driver, but the problem still exists. Then it means the PowerPoint is not compatible with your printer. As in my case, I use Epson LX3110. I already updated the driver, but the problem still remains. Let me show you in this video. I will report Epson LX3110 as my default printer. To set default printer, open printers and device or printer and faxes in older window. In window 10, click search. Type printers. Click device and printers. Right click at the printer name, click set as default printer. Now let's see how it looks when I use Epson LX3110. It looks bad. If this is the case, then we just have to use the dummy printer as our default printer. Anyway, if you can see fax or Microsoft print to PDF in this menu, then you can use this as default printer instead, without have to create a dummy printer as in the beginning of the video. Let's try it. I will choose Microsoft print to PDF. Right click, set as default. Open the PowerPoint. Now you can see it's back to normal again. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to our channel to make you easier to find us.